that is fun for sure. So I assume that you're set, you're special. What's your special called? Take your time. Ah. Is it called take your time because it's your first special and you've been doing this for a while? <laughs> no, but that's a that's a great question. Thank but you. no, it's uh it's I have another great question. Yeah. Will you stop touching your feet? I want I wanted to show you my socks. So they are nice. comment on them. Oh wow, do you have them for every day of the week? They yeah. say Wednesday. Yeah. Or are you just a big fan of uh Wednesday? I was gonna say, and I can't remember it. Tim, Tim Burton. Yeah, yeah, he did the, the those movies. Yeah, he's also doing. Um, Edward Scissors. He's also doing the new Beetlejuice that's coming out. Yeah, are we a fan of that? Yeah, of course. I'm a big fan of it. People aren't a fan of the remake. They think it's remake. Of Beetlejuice too. Yeah, well, yeah, that's you know, fun to see. Sister Act two, back in the habit, and there's a remake of Sister Mary Clarence going into witness protection. Yeah, I guess you're right. You're right. And you you're can right. quote me on it. We'll be right back. Be right back. And we're back. So I think that, yeah, I have um, I have every day of the week. And I will only wear them. I, I, I'm obviously, you have to. If you're going to have these type of socks. What happens if the, you didn't wear them on a Wednesday? So you go to your Thursday, your Friday, your Saturday, et cetera. Yeah. You're out of socks on a Saturday. That would never be a problem. I have other socks. You've never ran, you've never had, you've never been down to one pair of socks? No, I don't have No, I always have so, so many socks. I too have a lot of socks, but they're socks that I keep for some reason. I guess they're my emergency socks, yeah. but I have the socks that I like, and I have been down to, oh, this is my last pair of socks, I better do laundry now, yeah. or tomorrow I have to wear my socks that I don't love. Yeah, I mean, I wear these only in the daytime, and then my nighttime socks are all the same socks. I've, I've, I've talked about this before, I, not that you would know, but I one time, like uh, two years ago, threw away all my socks, and then I went and bought 36 pairs of the same socks so I don't have to like... Was it expensive? No, it's like you go to like, uh, you know, Target or whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah. Was it expensive? Yeah. Well, that sucks. Yeah. But at least I don't have to, I just, I can open up my drawer with my eyes closed if I want to and I know I'm gonna have to yeah. match. Uh, I, I do enjoy, sometimes I'll be like, why am I not just bought reloading yeah. my, my, my socks and underwear? Stupid way to, like the only reason we do laundry is because we ran out of socks and underwear. Not because of shirts. That's not the case for me. Shirts is actually not joking. Shirts is when I decide. Okay, so like, let me give you an example. You're wearing this shirt now. You put this shirt on after the shower, correct? Yeah, it's an indoor shirt. Yeah. Once I go outside, not outside like when I walk through. If I go outside and I sit anywhere or lean up against anything, this is now an outdoor shirt. Correct. Until I wash it. Okay, but like, would you throw that in the hamper tray or no? Because it's not dirty. If I if I if I went in my car. Then this is no longer an indoor shirt. Shirt. So I would, when I get home, I would take it off. I would put it down on the top of my hamper, the clothes hamper. Because yeah. basically, I have a section where it's not that it doesn't need to be washed yet, but it's but it's, it's not indoors anymore. So okay. then, like, so like, I'll put on an indoor shirt, and then if I have a show tonight, yeah. Um, yeah. Not actually, my husband, I have a show tonight. I show because I didn't go, so I'll probably have a show tonight. Yeah. But like, if I if this were if this were outdoors, yeah, then I would take it off, I'd put it in your shirt, and then when I leave for my show, I'd either keep the shirt I have on, or I would be like, I keep wearing this, and I would put this back on, and then it's dirty. Yeah, you're a really good sport. Um, I, 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 I'll go home, and take this off, and hang it back on. Okay, what? Yeah. yeah, not here. No judgment. Yeah, yeah no judgment. I just want to know that it's not like crazy stuff.
when I go on another person's podcast and they don't know me, it's an uphill battle. <laughs> I get that. It's it's good to know that most of them want to stand to you. I don't think that's the it's case. Not. I think there is a certain type of person that comments. Yeah. Which is it's like it's like uh, if you go to a restaurant and you really like it, there's less of a chance of you going on Yelp and saying this restaurant's great, then if you don't like it. Yeah. I learned from my mom that I don't just do it on Yelp, like when something is nice, I now also like I'll tell the people using the restaurant for dinner, but usually it's gonna be the waiter. I'll tell the waiter how great they are. But I'll also ask to talk to the manager. I do that at a lot of That's terrifying in your service. No, I don't say let me talk to the manager or something <laughs> like that. Like close ended. You know, it's, it's like I think you're so fabulous. I think that my mom's a fabulous. I don't say that's so funny that I just said fabulous. Mm-hmm. You are so fabulous. I want to like I want to like, talk to the manager so they know. 